everyone, welcome back to my channel and for today's video, oh it's Therese by the way, and for today's video we have the Coco Collection by Kylie Cosmetics. So this is the collaboration she did with her sister Chloe, um, a few odd years ago now, I'm a bit late to the game but I just got them and I thought that I would do a review on them and see what they are like. So without further ado, let's crack into the first shade. So these are a bit dinged up because I did get given them. But this is the packaging here, and it is a very gold, it's got those teardrops there, those makeup drops, and it says Coco there. And then on the bottom it has the shade. So we'll start with Damn Gina, and we'll just open it up. So this is a gloss, and it has that signature, like, caramel, like, amazing scent on there. So this is the gloss here, and it looks like it's got some kind of glitter in it, maybe? Like a brown kind of glitter. Alrighty, let's swatch her on my mouth and see what it's like. Definitely glittery, definitely. Oh my god, it's kind of iridescent. Oh my god, I love it. I love it. Do you see that? It's like iridescent, iridescent like glitter. Oh my god, this is amazing. And that is damn Gina there. I really love this shade. The fact that it's a gloss but it kind of has glitter in it as well. So you could put it as a topper on any kind of lip gloss. I really like that. And it's just such a pretty kind of nude glitter color. Mm, damn Gina. Damn girl. For our next shade. I ditched my hat because it's getting very warm in here. For the next shade we have shade Chloe. So let's zoom her on in here. And it just looks like a nude kind of brown shade very warm toned nude. I'm like again is this going to be a collection that I absolutely fall in love with and need for the rest of my life? We'll see. Yes. Yes definitely. <laughs> and that is shade Chloe there. Or like Chloe money. It's like Chloe money. But that is it there and I think it's just a really pretty warm toned nude. I'm glad that this was one of the first few ones because it's a really versatile one that I think many skin tones could wear but that is shade Chloe Money. Now we have a shade Oku. So this is, I didn't say that right, Oku. That is like a drag queen term and it's just like a very hot, hot, hot pink. I am loving this colour here. Alrighty, so this is shade Okur. And it's like a very, like it's the same colour as my hair. This colour is legit the same colour as my hair. I love it. And I love that it's pretty much dry already, it's great. That is like dried up already on my lips. I love, 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 love this colour. It's just popping off my mouth. Like my mouth is just like. I love this. I don't want to take it off and swatch the next one because this is my favourite. And last but not least, we have shade Gorge. And I feel like this is a very dark kind of vampy red kind of colour. Which I'm not too keen on. I feel like the colours as a set do look a bit strange. But that is it there. I've had this before in a mini and I feel like I didn't like it then. And still don't really like the colour now. No doubt I'll put it on and probably like it though. Because that seems to be happening with all of them. So this is Shade Gorge. It's like painting blood on. So I found that this one was very wet and very hard to work with. But that is the colour Gorge there. And it, yeah, I won't lie, it's a nice colour on me. I personally just don't... It's all over my teeth. Ugh. I just personally don't like vampy kind of dark shades that are in the red department because my hair used to be like I'm a natural ginger I don't really like to go near red hues that's why I like the pink kind of hues 
As for the set, I don't think it's too bad. You get a gloss, you get three val um you get you get a gloss, you get three mattes. I think that that's a pretty good deal. Um the color situation is really weird. I think it's a weird combo of colors. I do like that there's two nudes in there and there's like a bright kind of dark vampy red, then like a bright ready kind of pink. But I just think that the color combo is just a really weird combination to put in there. I do like the lip lipsticks, got me don't get me wrong. Ugh. I do like the lipsticks, don't get me wrong. Um, they are very good quality. Um, I definitely would wear these again. Um, just the colour combo I think is really weird. But I do love these. I think that they're amazing. And I would definitely, 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 definitely wear them again. And I probably would buy them again. Okur was my favourite shade because I love saying that. I feel like this was definitely my favourite shade here. And what do you guys think of the packaging? Do you think it's too gold? Do you think it needed to be a bit different? I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below. And until next time, I love you guys so much. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye.